Hey everyone, it's Tay with Spectacular Gadgets and in this video I'm going to do the unboxing and let you see my first time using the Osmo Mobile 2 gimbal. Let's open it. So I'm going to show signs of a struggle because this is a one-handed unboxing, one-handed record. I uh, totally forgot my tripod. Upon opening the flap, you're greeted with the Osmo Mobile 2 manual. We'll set that aside. Then let's go ahead and get into the main box. And upon pulling this out, the case feels like a uh, styrofoam. So let's go ahead and open this up. We are greeted with the gimbal itself. And look at that nice branding on the inside of the case. Osmo Mobile, cool beans. So next we will take, let's take the nerds out for later. And here is your charging cable. Looks to be USB to uh, micro USB. So, okay, we'll put that back and let's pull out the gimbal from the case. So there's a little bit of weight to this thing, but it feels like a good weight. It feels that it's sturdy in your hands. Here's the handle and going up here, right here is where you will place your mobile device. So that swivels a little bit and here's the Osmo branding. Nice touch. You see the slight swivel. So this button right here, this big black one is for you to tilt the phone. And this button right here is to take pictures and record. The little button right here is to power the device. Here is your wide angle and your telephoto angles that you can slide up and down to get either whatever one you would like. Over here is where you plug in the cable to charge the device. So moving right along, this little dial right here you will use this to adjust the piece where the, the part that you hold the phone in, depending on what size phone you have, you will have to adjust that so that it can balance correctly. So I'll sit this down gently so I can go ahead and take a look at the base. So this is what you will put the gimbal in to sit on a flat surface. So this is the box that the base comes in and let's go ahead and open this quickly. One handed unboxings are not the easiest, but we'll get through this together. So let's open up the box. Here is the base. It has a nice weight to it. Let's go ahead and flip this over. You see there are four rubber feet for no sliding. Also a little screw to tighten the gimbal to the base. Here's the bottom of the gimbal. Here are the pieces put together. You'll need to go ahead and download the app to get it started. So I will go ahead and press install. You'll have to go through a little bit of uh, permissions and accept all the permissions as usual. We'll proceed and let's go ahead and install the app. Let's open the app up and see what we have. Okay. Ooh, terms and use. We'll speed this up. Boom, boom, boom. Don't want it. Nope. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, so now that we have installed the app and finally balance the note on the gimbal, you can go ahead and take a look at some of the video footage that we shot using the Note 9 and the gimbal. So I already see off the top that it is a much smoother video. It's not so shaky. The transition is nice when you turn around. So just go ahead and sit back and enjoy some of the footage that I took this day and I will stop talking right now.
I don't know if it's just me, if my eyes are playing tricks on me, but it looks like he totally was looking at me at first and then turned to my partner here shooting this video. That's creepy. I had to slow that down just so you guys can see that. Let me know in the comments if you saw that too. Okay, carry on as you were. This footage right here was using the hyperlapse feature that is part of the app. So bringing it back home, this concludes the first use of the Osmo Mobile 2 gimbal. Let me know in the comments what you thought about this video. And until next time, peace.